Probably for the church. Oh God. Why don't you manage? I was so sure I didn't have it. I'd really got it into my head that I wasn't. I feel like I'm going to pass that out. Please be upstanding to greet the bride. Lauren and Luke, are you ready, freely and without reservation, to give yourselves to each other in marriage? I am. I am. <laughs> are you ready to love and honour each other as man and wife for the rest of your lives? I am. I am. <laughs> Luke Thomas Hodges, will you take Lauren and Sutherland here present for your lawful wife, according to the right of our Holy Mother, the Church. I will. Lauren Ann Sutherland, will you take Luke Thomas Hodges here present for your lawful husband, according to the right of our Holy Mother, the Church. I will. Where are we going? How did you manage that? I was so shocked. I knew it was all about the church, getting the church. Getting the church was a coup. But how will Luke's grand stately home go down with the bride who wanted an Italian trattoria? You ready? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think then? Nice, no, it's good, bye. You sure? Yeah, honestly. Positive? Positive. Wow. Uh, it? Yeah, it's beautiful. All right, let me get out and then open the door. For okay. You. The location may be grand, but Luke hasn't forgotten it's the personal touches that count. Look at these, I was up to whatever oh time God. last night. It's beautiful, babe. His thoughtful choice of favours is a public gesture of love for their baby daughter. Little poppy seeds in there and then everyone can sprinkle them in their gardens and when they come up every year it remind them of our wedding. Oh, you've done really well, it's beautiful. And for Lauren, the day just gets better and better. Three cheers for Mr. and Mrs. Hodges. Hip hip. Hooray! Hip hip. Hooray! Hip hip. Hooray! I've got to take these knickers off. Magic knickers, I'm sweating it out. I've just been really lucky to have found Lauren and got Lauren, so hopefully now we're going to live happily ever after. Yeah. And, uh, Raise a glass to Lauren, and uh, I love you. Oh, Luke, babe, this day is just amazing, and this is why I want to be your wife. Oh. I love you so much. You make me so proud. Yeah. 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 
and our Mrs Hodges. I'm glad they went well. It could have been a lot worse. We could have had registry office and the pub. One stage that as an option. I personally think this is better than the location in Italy. Even though that was stunning and the feeling you got there was amazing, that's linked to Lauren's past as well. That's why she feels emotional towards it. But this is her own day and her own wedding. She'll always remember this now. And one of these little bridesmaids, they might end up wanting something like this, like she did from her auntie when she was a bridesmaid for her. So, because it's beautiful. You're going to just what you saw. I, I've always said like, I didn't really want to stay at home because anyone could get married there. They do weddings every day of the week. But like, it's been absolutely beautiful. And something that I might have bypassed and said, no, I don't want to do, coming in today has made me think it's absolutely amazing. Mm -hmm. So I'm really surprised. It's beautiful. Yeah. Happy. yeah. Really happy. You've done really well. I'm a little bit of Italy to the reception. Oh, ha ha. <laughs> oh, I feel like I'm in Venice. See what it, see what it is, as you got him. <laughs>